I'm not sure who needs to hear this message, but your 2024 is going to be amazing. You see, God is going to be with you every single step of the way. His word says he'll never leave you nor forsake you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. Let me hitchhike right quick. See, I got my thumb up. And you see, the world, they going to pass me by. <laughs> you feel me? That's how it is in the world. They ain't going to look out for you, dog. So why would you want to go with the world? World ain't going to pick you up when you try to hitchhike. Oh, but see, when it comes to God, I promise you, all you got to do is spiritually hitchhike and say, Lord, I can't do this no more. Lord, I don't want to walk on my own. Lord, I'm tired of trying to figure it out. Lord, I'm out in the middle of nowhere. Lord, I'm in a deserted place. There's no people, no, no anything. Uh, my troubles, my fear, my doubts, my unbelief, all that stuff is consuming me. Boy, stick that thumb up. Because here come Jesus. <laughs> here come Jesus. He pulled over. He opened the door. He said, welcome back to Marcus. <laughs> and then, then, then I start saying, Lord, oh, forgive me for doing this. Forgive me for doing this. And that's what Jesus said to Marcus. Didn't you already pray about that about an hour ago? That's done with the Marcus. Forget about the past. You've already repented. You stick your thumb up. I accept you. Just like the prodigal son. The Bible says he, when he came to himself. He realized he had it better in his father's house. And then the scripture says when he was afar off, like returning to the father, the father went over there and embraced him with a big hug. That's what Jesus wants you to do. Stop trying to go into the world and do it your own way and put your thumb up and spiritually hitchhike. And God picks you up. Oh, his word says casting all your cares upon him because he cared for you. What that mean, Demarcus? All the luggage I'm carrying, the suitcase, the backpack, all this stuff that's burned me down on this lonely road. When God spiritually picks you up from hitchhiking, he takes, he, he popped the trunk. He said, Demarcus, give me that bag. The, the Marcus, give me that luggage. Give me your suitcase. The Marcus, put everything in my trunk because I'm built to carry your load. I don't want you stressing and trying to figure it out on your own. Thank you for putting your thumb up. I'll be taking care of all your worries this year, Demarcus. <laughs> but what I need you to do, Demarcus, I need you to stay in the passenger seat and don't get out and wander on there trying to do it yourself. If you choose to stick with God, 2024, you know how you know what God wants to show you. <laughs> Why we like to get out the car? And I'm not sure about you, but 2023, I messed some things up, man. I'm gonna get it right this year, cause the whole time I'm staying in the passenger seat. Oh, and it gets better. It gets better, cause see when you rolling with God, you got that peace. He said he give you the peace that surpasses all understanding. I'm so glad I ain't got to drive the vehicle. I'm so glad I ain't got to make the decisions which way to turn, what to do this, what to do that. I can rest. I'm in the passenger seat. I got Jesus. He's already defeated death. He's already defeated the enemy. He's already did all that for me. Victory is not something we achieve like a goal. No, victory is something we receive as a gift because of he in whom we believe to be our savior. The battle's already won. I don't fight this fight for the position of victory. No, I fight it from the position of victory because, see, I'm hitchhiking with God and he's a winner. And since I'm in Christ, I'm a winner, too. <laughs> and while I'm on this drive with God, looking at the view, guess what I'm looking for, boy? I'm looking for more hitchhikers. I'm looking for people like you who may have their thumb up and say, hey, 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 DeMarcus, I'm burned down too. Can I, can, can I follow Jesus too? Absolutely. The Bible says, whosoever shall, in Romans chapter 10, whosoever shall call on the name of the Lord shall be saved. Come on, let's load up. Everybody get in. We rolling with Jesus for 2024. All my nose running out here, boy, it's cold. We rolling with Jesus. Let's get in the car. He got the heat on, man. Why you want to be out here freezing by yourself? Why you want to do 2024 by yourself? By your, by your own self. Come on, man. We rolling with Jesus all 2024, baby. Hey, you in? I need to know. I love you so much. If you made it to the end of this video, I need you to hit the like button. Then I need you to comment the words, I'm rolling with Jesus all 2024. Because that's right. We done hitchhiked, man. <laughs> I gave him all my cares, all my worries. <laughs> I'm ready for the new year. Today is day one. You got me? One day or day one, you decide. Don't be talking about, oh, one day I'm going to follow Jesus when, when I, I get done with, with doing everything I need. No, not one day. It's day one. 
this is the first day of the rest of your life, this is going to be the best year of your life. Because we rolling with Jesus. I love you so much. I'll see you in the next video.